The next competition is a frisbee throwing competition. You'll be throwing the frisbee, trying to hit that tree. If you hit the tree, you keep moving. We'll be moving further and further away from the tree. All right? Okay, Andrew going first. Oh! <laughs> No, that is true. Because uh, yeah, that is the point. What's gonna happen? Because if he makes if he makes it far enough, then it's like he's the he's gonna be he's the, the story for the jury, you know. And he's also gonna be the one to start fucking with alliances. How many people are left? Eight people are left. So we need at least five. Over. We could get five of us, right? Necessarily, that's who we should go for. Now, but Paul's right. Yeah. 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 Is if he stays, he's gonna mess with the alliances and try and get people to split up, and he has the power to do that. He's not. What are you he's thinking? Like what are you playing. thinking? I feel like it's that's the thing. I don't know. What were you guys talking about? I don't know. They didn't really know my name. So they said they mentioned Andrew, but that was it. I'm like, I think it seems like a the easy go. We get it done with, and then we don't have to worry about him in the future. But it, it could be swing for if we need to swing. You know? But don't you? But I. But I get worried about the swing forward because then it, that gives him too much power. I just don't think he's thinking. It's but it's like, at all. wait, but that's nor that's that's not. I mean, like, I I could be part of his play. Yeah, like, I I wouldn't. To be honest, I am kind of working with everyone, which I think is advantageous and problematic because I think for now I feel safe, which not good. Um, but uh, there are some really crafty people here. I don't know which side you're on. Why he's always like giving me praise and so I keep thinking I think this is my sign. I do too. I right. really think he is. So I wonder if it's I think it's probably I think so too. I think yeah, I feel I feel much more comfortable. Boy, I guess what the question is, do you feel could like stronger about being like Being like with the three of us? Or I think it's pretty good. But I but I I think I think and also if you vote out she has no choice to do. And also just like doesn't want to get broken. And we're like actually, we're like probably the tightest ones here. Yeah. Like out of everybody. Like, like we're the question. three who's not going to pass. And so I feel like it's important to send us to like stick with the majority. So what should we, should we do? No, should we, should we, should we? Should we, should we Are you just going to let them hang around? around? Yeah. 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 You're just not thinking at all. We can, like I just, I just, I feel like, Feeling good. Obviously, I'm safe for this route, but um, right now I feel pretty good with Sophie and Zeke, and then I think like Andrew and Andrew um, as well. But hopefully, this route will go the way. I'm, if this vote goes the way I'm expecting it to, then I'll feel good. All right. So I think the final five I have is with Sophie and Andrea and Danny and Andrew. The wild card's Andrew. I think he's with me, but I don't know. And if he's not in this vote, if Sophie gets voted out, my game's a little fucked and I'm just scrambled. This is dire. This is dire situation. But I think if we get Paul out, then we'll get Mikey out, and then we can get Alex out. Then we'll probably get Andrew out. Though I might have to make a move before then. The question is, do, how far do you take Sophie and Andrea? Andrea, who's an all-star, who's played like the real Survivor twice, and Sophie, who's won. So I feel like I trust them, but I'm like, do I take them to the end and nobody votes for them? That's like the major question for me. I don't know. They were trying to get you out. I don't know. Who? Who is Paul and Who is that supposed to be? Who is the one saying it? Paul is the one saying it? Don't, but don't really repeat that. Okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. 
I do too. Because okay. you're a mom right now. I am. <laughs> That's why I'm like, fuck. <laughs> so, so we could use Sophie and that movie for this photo. Who would you guys want to take out though? No, I was thinking maybe take out one of them. One of them? Yeah. I feel like they would vote with us though. Do you not know, think Andrew and Paul would go with us? I think they're very close. Mm -hmm. Sophie? I think I can trust Sophie. Do you think you can trust Andrew? I or do. Paul? I, mean, I definitely Paul? don't trust Paul. I, like, I trust I like you guys. I like you guys. I like yeah, I want to. You guys want to stick with this three? Yeah. I trust them. Okay. three. Oh, well, I'm going to yeah. talk. That's what I was thinking. Uh, so right now I feel like I'm in a good spot. I feel like at least I have two people who trust me, you know, pretty wholeheartedly. And I think Andrea does as well. So I have my original alliance of um, Zeke and Danny, and then I have Andrea. Uh, my thing right now is about just to make sure that Zeke and Danny feel comfortable with me. I don't know if I want to go to Penn with them. I promise it to them. Um, but they're two really likable guys, and they're underdogs, and I'm not sure I could win against them. So right now, I think the next vote, I'm really thinking about the end game and where I want to place myself. Don't talk to other no, did my name come up? A little bit. But I mean, I'm hey, this is I I said, you can trust me. Oh. God, this is a lot stressful than I thought it was going to be. And apparently, I suck at every single freaking challenge that there is. Jesus Christ. Could there be something about sewing or something? Anyways, I have no idea who is in control of this game. I hope this elimination turns out. I've heard my name brought up. I really need to win immunity next time. Well, Sophie's, just, Sophie's controlling it. Yeah, I'm going to take out one of her numbers. Yeah. Yes, I agree. So, I think so. They think they're taking out They do? Yeah. What, what did you that get? That they have five over Wait, there right they now. Wait, they did mention that I but nothing. Who did? They're mentioning me. That's what they're talking about. Andrew. Get Andrew. Getting no, no, no. cigarette for this bad boy. This has been the hardest round I've ever played in Survivor Book, and I am really going against my gut here. They all want Zeke. The best I could do is make it a tie. I, uh, I'm not doing the right thing. I don't trust Paul at all. I want him out immediately. Him and Andrew are too strong, and I feel like they're voting Zeke. I don't know. Lose trust with Sophie and Zeke would have stayed with me, but. Sometimes you have to like roll with the game, I guess, so that's what I'm trying to do. I don't know, I've heard like a few names toss around. I'm scared. I don't even know where Alex's head is at either. I don't know I'm with a few different people. You know, you never know who you're really with. Uh, I feel like I can trust Mikey, uh, Andrea maybe, Paul maybe. Uh, I'm trying to align myself a little bit with Andrew because I saw he was by himself and I feel like he'd be a good number so I've been trying to work with him a little bit. Uh, right now I'm targeting, I feel like Sophie has uh, two players kind of around her finger so right now we're trying to weaken her a little bit and hopefully you know make it an even game because I feel like a three is kind of really powerful right now so hopefully We'll be able to do that, open the game up a little bit, and see what happens. I think we only change all because my two people, like Mikey's with us, and yeah. three of us, he's with I think Mikey might have to get you, but I talk to them, like us three, and my, my three people are like firm with you, and Alex is firm with you. They just want to get Paul up first, so I feel like we get Paul up this time, and okay. Mikey out next time. Okay. Because Mikey is like, he is like semi, not this round at all. Yeah. Really have control He's now. like semi cunning for you, and we have control of him right now. Okay, okay. Are you promise? I guarantee you. <laughs> you do not get it. Yeah. Yeah. So I'll let it play in my No, do not lay. Okay. I promise. I promise you. It's gonna be all those people up there. Actually, not all. Sorry, my my two people and Andrew. I'm pretty sure are all good. Okay. So it's kind of freaking me out, but I think this is where it draws the line on the alliances, and I do think I can trust Alex, Paul, uh, Mikey to an extent, and kind of Andrew, because we have this weird thing going on where he knows I'm an idol, I know he's an idol, I know. So it's kind of complicated. I really hope it's not me and I'm not an idiot and go out with two idols. See? Why is he? 
to keeping you in the game longer. I know. That's why, I, like, I, I can't trust you. I feel like I can't trust anybody, but, um... But you need to start thinking about long term. That's what I'm trying to do. It's really hard, though, when you're, like, you're trying to find the group to... You're lucky right now because you are in this swimming boat. I know. Final eight. Oh, yeah, because that's right. All right, so, uh, Frisbee challenge. Turns out, none of you very good at Frisbee. <laughs> uh, you know, sometimes that happens. Danny did barely hit the tree. <laughs> <laughs> you what know, I think with this group, none of the wrists are very firm. And, uh, <laughs> Fair enough. Difficult. Fair enough. Well, we, do have, we do have straight Alex on the group. So. <laughs> uh, all right, so... Danny, I'll ask you the same question I've been asking other people. How does it feel to wear the immunity necklace? Feels good. I, 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 I guess I don't feel nervous. I'm, yeah. I'm a pretty anxious person normally, so I'm glad to not have to be anxious. <laughs> <laughs> so I saw a lot of different groups going around. Um, Andrew, what do you think you have a grasp of what's going on, or are you going to be surprised by tonight's event? Um, I think I think that there has been a lot of talk, and it's hard to trust everyone in this environment. Okay. Mikey, do you still feel like things are being decided right now, even at Tribal Council? Absolutely. Yeah? Do you, do you think you know what's going on, Alex? No, you see, I brought my stuff here. You brought his stuff, <laughs> all right. Okay. Uh, Sophie, are you feeling vulnerable tonight? I've lost count, but I think I've been voted for in like, the last four Tribal Councils. Yeah, you've been getting some votes. <laughs> Never enough, though. Never enough. I, you know, I'm hoping my frizzy performance like really <laughs> opens people's eyes like the amount of threat that I am. <laughs> you did. I think you're the one that almost hit the first juror, Kevin. Yeah. 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 I don't even have a jury vote yet. <laughs> <laughs> um, Paul, uh, how are you basing your vote? I am confused. There was lots and lots of chatters. Okay. Zeke, are you feeling vulnerable? Extraordinarily vulnerable. This is the, honestly the first time I've watched a travel council and I'm like, not sure what's going to happen. <laughs> okay, we are going to vote. Uh, the strategy behind this, but I don't have time to really go into all of it right now. Uh, uh, yeah. This is the wrong vote. This has been the hardest vote for me ever in Survivor Brooklyn. This will either win or lose me the game. The whole time we were on the second set of tribes, you just never really would talk to me, even though we're on the same side. I just can't trust you, man, and I think I have good reason not to trust you. I hope this vote goes the way I think it goes. I'm still here. Uh, maybe just for now. I don't know. Um, the person that I'm voting for right now... You know, I think my strategy is working. Um, you know, get everyone to love you, and then just play the odds. So. I've heard that it's between you and me, and I really, really, really hope that it's you. I'm so sorry. It was wonderful being on that team with you and losing all those challenges, but um, I wish you the best of luck. Paul, we saved you at Merge, and I think you're gunning for me now, which is kind of rude. I think you're amazing. I do not want to vote you out, but we're trying to make in Sophie's little force that she's got going on. I just don't know where your head is at, and you're very strategic, and that makes me nervous. All right, if anyone has a hidden immunity idol, now would be the time to play it. Okay, I will read the votes. First vote, Paul. Zeke. One vote Paul, one vote Zeke. Paul. Two votes Paul, one vote Zeke. Zeke. Tie 2-2, two, two, Paul and Zeke. Paul. Three votes Paul, two votes Zeke. Zeke. The tie 3-3. Three, three. Zeke. It's four votes Zeke, three votes Paul. The 11th person voted out of Survivor Brooklyn, second member of the jury, Zeke. Please bring me your torch. Zeke, the tribe has spoken. Well, I got blindsided. I thought I really had the numbers. I thought I like solidified it, but I guess there are some people uh, that I shouldn't have trusted. But, well, I don't know. That on me. That on me. I was, chatting a little too much. I was being quiet initially. I think I should have continued to be quiet. So, ah, uh, alas, bamboozled.